Hello everyone. Uh, today I'm going to be demoing the Super Dispatch Connection Chrome extension. This extension will help CRM users move their orders from their CRM into Super Dispatch with a single click of a button. So the first step is you will need to download the Chrome extension. So in Google, go ahead and search for Super Dispatch Connection and it will pull up one of the results will be the web store. So when you click here, you'll open the web store. In my case, I've already downloaded the extension. Uh, for you, this button will say add to Chrome. So click on that button, add it to Chrome, and you can go ahead and click out of this tab. So in this case, my CRM of choice is message plane. So I have now opened a test order in message plane right here. This is my test order with all of the required information filled out. As you can see at the top of message plane, you'll see a post to super load board button. When you click here, you should get a message that says the order has been posted to super load board, as well as a link to the order in the TMS itself. If the order did not post successfully, you'll get another message that indicates which fields that you need to make changes to in order to post this correctly. So in this case, I wanna go ahead and open the TMS. So I'm gonna click on this link, which is now opening Shipper TMS, and you can see this order has been successfully posted to Super Load Board. So I'm gonna go back to Message Plane and I'm going to also show you that you have the ability to unpost an order. So in this case, if I click here from unpost, you'll get a similar message here. And now this order has been removed from the load board. It still exists in Shipper TMS though. If you would like to change the status within the TMS itself, you can always click here and enter, with it, enter in Super Dispatch's Shipper TMS as well. So in this case, I'm going to click OK. Um, I'm sure that whenever all those changes happened, you saw that this panel over to the right has opened up. This shows you status and really critical information about your loads in real time within the CRM itself. So this is handy because users of the CRM don't have to necessarily jump over to a TMS to see where their load is at. Um, so I'm going to show you an example here that I've pre-populated. In this example, um, I have, as a shipper, I have found a carrier that would like to take the load. They accepted the load, assigned a driver, and the driver has picked up the load. The type of information that you're gonna see as a user in the CRM is you'll see the order status, and these statuses change from accepted to picked up to delivered and any of the statuses that you see in Shipper TMS, you will also see here. Of course, the order number that links you directly to that order in Shipper TMS. In this case, I have a picked up date and time. I also happen to have a delivery ETA. This particular driver has sent an ETA to the carrier that has been passed on to you so you can see what their new ETA is. And this particular driver is sharing their location as well. So 33 minutes ago, they were located in Nashville, Tennessee. Lastly, we're also including carrier information down here, including their contact information so that you can reach out to them with any questions uh, without having to go into the TMS. So that's it for the demo of the end-to-end -end flow. Thank you.